hey, this is automated a lot. And in this video, I just want to show you really quick how to change the opacity of almost any element in Unbounce just using a little custom style sheet. And for that, I created a Google Doc. Link is down in the description and it looks like this. So here I have the style sheet and what you have to do is just replace this element ID part with the ID of the element you want to have the changed opacity on. And here you can select the opacity in percent or you can enter a decimal value like 0.5, which would be equivalent to 50%. And to implement it, just select the style, go to your landing page, create a new style sheet. Let's call this opacity, paste it. And now we have to get an element ID. So when you are using images in Unbounce, the page builder doesn't let you change the opacity of the image. So let's do it with a style sheet. And for that, you select the image on the right, scroll down until you see the ID, which is LP POM image 219 in this case. Copy it, go back to your style sheet, and paste the ID here. And as opacity, let's select 35%. And now if I click done, save it, and go to preview, you see we have our logo image here with a lowered opacity and we can see the background through the image. Now for images, this is already really useful, but I like to use it for boxes because if I go back to edit and add a box, you can change the opacity when you have this background style solid color. But if you select a gradient, which often is a great style element for the background design of a section, you can no longer select the opacity. And now if I send it backwards, select border none, and use a custom gradient to a little bit darker color like this, I can just go back to the style sheet, add an extra line. So just copy this line here, paste it. And now here you just enter the ID of the box. So when I click done and select the box. On the right, I scroll down and here it's LP POM box 287. So back to the style sheet, paste the ID and here I select 15%. And now again, if I click done, save it and go to preview, you see we still have our logo image with the lowered opacity, but now we also have this box with a gradient and also lowered opacity. And this works for text elements, for buttons and almost any element on your Unbounce landing page. I'm not sure if this works for videos, but if you give it a try, please let me know down in the comments. Okay, and that's it. Thanks for watching and see you next time.